they've grown attached to Esau. They, they've, trust, they've trusted in their oppressor. They've trusted in their oppressor more than the most high. And that's why the, the judgment that's coming upon them is righteous, man. You know, like I was saying to the brothers earlier this week, man, the, uh, uh, what David said, man, the mo most high, uh, uh, he, 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 he said the most high's uh, uh, terrible righteousness, man. His righteousness is terrible, man. But it's only terrible to those who who really don't. It's terrible, but it's righteousness because it's judgment. The Most High is all about judgment. Yahweh Bashim Yashah is all about judgment. Okay, so to the unbelievers, to the, the other nations, they feel like the Most High's judgment is terrible. It It is, but it's righteous though. Okay, only if you if you serve him, then you would you understand that you would understand his judgment. Okay, he's got to judge Babylon. He's got to judge America. He has to. Okay, because this place is a cancer on the earth, man. Okay, because this place promotes death, man. It doesn't promote life. This place promotes homosexuality, man. This place promotes a, 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 a one world government. And the Most High is totally against those things. He, were totally, he was totally against those things from the very beginning. Okay, and his son doubled down on that. But everybody likes to take what the Lord said. And, and uh, well, Esau, like, Esau and two thirds of our people like to take what the Lord said and, and, and change it, in, change it into something else. Okay, they, 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 they skip the key points of what the Lord came to do. Okay, so they could fulfill the lust of their own flesh, fulfill the lust of their heart. Okay, wanting the one world government, wanting the one world, one world government, wanting homosexuality. That's not life. That's bondage, man. That's not liberty. That's slavery, man. Okay. Because you're not, you're not, you're not living on the earth according to the way the Most High created it for you to live on, okay? But you trust more in Esau and his way, where well, you're going to receive that judgment, man, all right? All right, and, and just so I can wrap this up, man, you know, there is liberty in the Lord, man. You just have to have faith, man. You have to, ha you have to take that leap of faith. And you have to 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 endure in this truth in order to understand. The Most High is going to bless you more abundantly the longer you stay in this truth, because you as you stand as you're in the truth as you're in the spirit of the Lord, you get to actually see the error in the people. Okay, and that builds up your faith. Okay, and that that builds up your understanding of why you shouldn't do uh, the things that the Most High told you not to told you not to do. OK, you when the Lord said not to do something, you have to be patient in order to be taught. And once you're you once you once the Lord, the Lord is going to bless you in due season in due time. OK, but you have to have patience in order to receive those things. You have to have faith in order to receive those things. This is the world that we live in. It's fast paced and everything is now, 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 now. And a lot of a lot of our own people don't have no faith. OK, their answer of all their 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 answer to all their problems in their mind is is money okay but they they that's just another excuse of of worshiping esau man okay because once esau's uh so-called money loses its value then what okay then what all the things that you've done in this life for that money now what you're gonna really see you yourself for who you are okay once that money means nothing anymore Okay, and a lot of people are going to be shamed, man, because and they're going they're not going to they're not going to be shamed and repent. They're going to they're going to uh, uh, a lot two thirds of our people they're going to be ashamed and they're going to continue doing wickedness, man. They're not, they're not going to want to serve the Lord. They're not going to want life. They're not going to want to humble themselves toward the Lord towards the Lord and live. Okay, but the Lord, the, those of us who humbled ourselves, those of us who humble themselves. Okay, those of our people, those of uh, uh, the Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans who humble themselves and serve the Lord, they're going to be given a sovereign mentality. Okay, you're going to have life wherever you go. Okay, because you're going to be in the spirit of the Lord. Just as uh, you're going to be as sovereign as we were in the wilderness. We didn't need anything else. The Lord blessed us with everything that we needed. He took care of us in the wilderness. He taught us how to tell time. Okay, using the sun. Using the, the the moon, you know, he he taught us how to uh, how to till the earth, all those things we have understanding. He taught us how to how to be amongst our neighbors and our family members. He's blessed us with that understanding, and he's blessed us with the understanding of how to deal with our own spirits. Okay, and that that's something that, you know, 
<laughs> is life, you know. But uh, this is uh before I close out. This is uh, you know, I just want to keep it simple, man. I try to keep the video simple, but you know, sometimes when you're in the spirit, you just go, you know. And I'm hella late. My lunch hour been <laughs> over with for the past 15 minutes. But you know, I I, I do it for you, Akim, man. Most definitely, I am. I, most definitely, I do it for you, how about how shy, man. But I do it for you know, for the brothers that listen, man. Cause the brothers that listen, you know, they believe in your how about shimmy how shy, man. You know, and if you believe in your how about shimmy how shy, man, you're my brother, and I wanna do these videos, man, to help, to help feed the Lord's elect, man. All right, hopeful elect. You know, we'll know who the elect are when we get on those chariots. But this is uh. Ecclesiastes 12 verse 13 it says let us hear the conclusion of the whole matter all right Akim y'all pay attention man all right it says fear the most high and keep his commandments for this is the whole duty of man okay that's the whole duty of man let me read it again Ecclesiastes 12 verse 13 let us hear the conclusion of the whole matter the ending of all our arguments the ending of all our debates okay the scripture says let us hear the conclusion of the whole matter fear the most high and keep his commandments for this is the whole duty of man okay the Lord said if you love me do what keep my commandments I want to give all praises to Yahweh Bahasham, Yahweh Shah, Bahasham, Raka, Kodash. I like to give double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone. I like to give salutations to the Akim preaching the gospel across the four corners of the earth in truth and in sincerity. Shalom, Akim. Shalom. Turn yourselves and live ye. Shalom.